Hey, what's up everybody? How's it going? I am the Framed and welcome back to the next episode of my Diablo 2 Lore Restriction Let's Play. Alright, so in the last episode we, as you can see, made our way into the World Stone Keep and then down into the Throne of Destruction, uh, which is where Bale is, or at least the way to Bale. Uh, in this episode we're going to be taking down Bale's minions or whatever and then finding our way to the Throne Room or the World Stone Chamber, I think it's called? I can't quite remember. Uh, but anyways, that's where we're going. Uh, to kill Bale and uh, complete the first difficulty, I guess. Uh, but anyways, let's get going here. We're going to use our burst of speed to start off and uh, switch back to our fists of fire and make our way through this area. All right, so what we're going to be doing... Uh, whoa! Uh, so these guys are strong. That's fun. Um, <laughs> that kind of really caught me off guard. Uh, but anyways, we have to fight uh, Bale's minions which are really strong there will be like four waves of bad guys uh, that Bale will throw at us and we have to take them down um, the first couple really aren't that bad the last couple are a little bit more bad um, so this I don't know how this is gonna go this is either gonna be fairly simple or completely terrifying um, <laughs> And, uh, but we're going to see how things go. I'm going to pick up all the potions that I find because chances are I'm going to be burning through potions like mad. Um, but, is there, yeah, there is enemies in here. Trying to take these, these, uh, furies down without dying. Oh my gosh. I've been slowed. You jerks. Alright, so we got to take these guys down, um, before they kill us. And they are slowing us like crazy. Alright. So we took all those guys down, uh, which means Bale's minions will be coming out here, and we got to be ready for them. Uh, there will be big waves, basically, of pretty difficult enemies, except for these first ones, which are nothing all that scary. He's immune to fire. That's not cool, man. I don't like that. Um, that's what we're going to be... Uh, that's what we have to look forward to in the later difficulties, uh, immunities, and it's super annoying, but it's whatever. Basically, what I'm going to try and do is keep my mercenary and my uh, my minion over there so that they get attacked by the demon spawn that comes out um, first instead of me because <laughs> I am uh, really awesome to my... Oh, please don't die. Ah, she died. That's okay because I can just resummon her right there. And I am taking a lot of damage, so I'm going to use a potion here. Uh, po uh, poison damage coming out from those guys. That's kind of annoying. And these guys are going to be hard, so I'm going to use a potion right off the bat. And holy cow, why am I so slow? Uh, oh. Please don't die, friend. These guys are just slowing me all over the place. Can't hit. Oh my gosh. You can you guys see this, right? I'm like moving so slow. Uh, is there another bad guy? Is he over here? Oh, he is over here. He's hiding. You're gonna die, boy. All right. So I want to resummon you. Make sure to use that. And uh, we're gonna use a potion for that. Oh wow, I am really low on potions. Shoot. Um, I'm scared. Because these guys are actually kind of hard. Well, she's dead. <laughs> and now they're going to gang up on me. So I'm probably going to have to run back to town because I am getting my butt handed to me. Um, yeah, I'm actually going to run back to town because I'm a little pansy. Um... Run over here and pick up a lot more potions. Gonna go boink, boink, boink. Uh, That's not what I want. That's what I want to do. And then pick up one more of these and head back. Uh, gonna bring her out really quick. Heal up. And we're gonna go back in. Hopefully I don't die. We're gonna, oops, we're gonna pop one of these guys open uh, just to be safe. And let's run in there oops I fail and uh, a good tactic for this is to 
kind of do what I just did here. Uh, try and single out the enemies. So run away, do some some uh, guerrilla tactics uh, is a good way to put it. Run away and get a few of them to um, just come at you instead of a whole big mob of them. Uh, it's a pretty good strategy. One I probably should have used from the start, start but uh, it's, it's no big. Uh, these next guys that are going to be coming out are going to be really hard. Uh, these are probably ow, the most difficult... Oh my gosh, I almost died. Um, and for these guys, I would use a similar tactic. So they aren't doing what I want them to do. Please. Hit. Uh, going to try and heal up my mercenary a little bit there. Try and take one down at a time. While my, uh, my minion distracts them. Thank you, minion, for uh, sacrificing yourself for the greater good, of course. And we are going to head back to town before he dies. Haha, -ha, I win. Um, let's see, we do need more potions, so I'm just going to grab some more of those. And use that and that. Go back to that. Heal up. Run this way this way and uh, put another, another portal down here and head back in hopefully I get some of them singled out doesn't look maybe Nah, it doesn't really look like I'm gonna be so lucky but that's okay we're gonna take these guys down without too much trouble hopefully and uh, trying to put out as much AOE damage as I can uh, I'm actually gonna try and take down the minions before I take down uh, the champion or the unique um, that is my strategy because uh, the minions are weaker and uh, so I can take them down faster and if I can take them down faster that means I can get rid of their damage output on me uh, that's just kind of my strategy for it ouch that really hurt and there we got that guy down now we got this uh, we have the unique that we need to take down yet um, spectral hit and it looks like we're gonna be taking him down there we go so we got that guy down we're gonna pick up these potions and uh, head back in here see if there's any more in here that we have to take down uh, it does not look like it and was that the last one I think that might have been the last batch of bad guys yeah so now Bale goes through that door and we have to follow him in there and take him down but before we do that we're gonna heal up grab all these potions and items that uh, they dropped and it looks like that's just about it I uh, didn't get any, get any uh, good item drops so we got a bunch of pot I cannot talk right now got a bunch of potions uh, we're gonna head back to town here though really quick and get these items identified and then we're gonna head in and kill Bale and that's gonna be it and here we go we're gonna get rid of that because that sucks we're gonna get rid of that because that sucks I'm gonna put these guys over here uh, get rid of that strength and poison resist that's actually pretty decent um, I don't know what to do with that right now so I'm gonna throw that there and uh, before I go and kill Bale I'm gonna use that use that I don't know why I use that uh, but anyways we're gonna heal up and uh, head on in now once you go through this door you cannot uh, go back through the door so don't bother putting up a portal out here um, but you can use a portal in the throne room or whatever world stone chamber I'm getting all these names wrong I apologize uh, the world in the world stone chamber uh, you can use teleportation portals but I was just trying not to use them because I think you do get better item drops from bosses if you don't use a portal on the same level that they are on uh, but chances are I will have to use a portal that's just kinda how it is um, but we're gonna see what we can do here we're gonna head on in hopefully we uh, we don't die because <laughs> that would be unfortunate but uh, I kinda wanna get my mercenary to uh, that is the fake uh, and the way you can tell the demon thing that is at the bottom underneath Bale uh, it is off center the one that is off center is Bale and he is being a little jerk and taking away all of my mana that is the fake this is not the fake this is really annoying I'm doing like no damage to him that's fun that is that's awesome alright so we're gonna head back to town I suck at this game go to town um, 
So that was bad. <laughs> As you can see, he is doing a lot of damage to me and to my, my mercenary. And I don't really know what to do right now. Let's use that. Talk to you again. Uh, pick up more potions, I guess. Go like that. And uh, head back in. Um... As you, as you could see, he's doing a lot of damage, and he's got his double out, which is super annoying, and and it keeps taking all of my mana, so I can't use my first fist of fire, and well, I'm gonna die. The heck, uh, I'm gonna go over here. And I am doing a fair amount. Oh, this is a fake. I suck at this game. Oh my gosh. Uh, oh well, let's just take this thing down so it's out of our way. And it's, as you can see, it's like not doing anything. It's just taking the beating, everybody. I'm gonna use a potion here really quick. Alright, so we took that thing down. Uh, it did freeze me, but that's no big deal. I'm gonna run around until that wears off. Then I'm gonna head in. And hopefully, he takes all my mana. That's awesome. Why can't you attack my mercenary? Mercenary, do so you see him? He's just like running around. The heck? Bro, do something useful. Go, attack. Idiot. <laughs> oh, my mercenary is so dumb. Come on. Alright, so I'm doing a little bit of damage, I guess. Uh, maybe I'll have to do this whole thing using it to auto attacks. That would suck. Uh, taking some damage, that's fun. Um, yeah. So Bale is really hard. It looks like I, I will be having to do this entire battle using my auto attacks or my normal attacks or basic attack or whatever you want to call it, which is super annoying. Uh, I'm going to use a potion here really quick because he's kicking my patootie. Um, Bale, you're too strong, man. Quit it. Uh, oh, really? All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to bring, we're just going to run over here. Hopefully the... Uh, clone comes back over here like the last time and we can just take it down um, from over here without the original and we're going to try and take this thing down quick gonna have to use a potion it looks like I can't hit anything I am I'm failing oh, this is so annoying all right so before my things wear off, I won't. I cannot hit a thing. I'm gonna die. Oh my gosh. And I know everybody says don't hit the the uh, the, the the clone, but I am taking down the clone because it is really in my way. It's doing a lot of damage to me. So I'm just gonna kill the clone, and you're gonna have to deal with it. Um, so this is kind of turning out to be like the last uh, boss fight with Diablo where I just kind of fail over the place, which is fine? I don't know. Probably not fine, but uh, we're going to heal up here and head back in because that's what we do. I'm actually going to use a portal right now. Uh, I don't know why I wasn't doing that earlier. And he has another clone out. That's, that's just fantastic. Awesome possum. I don't know which one this is. This is the clone. Um, but it's in my way and I need to take it down. And all this cold damage coming out. Gonna use a potion, of course. And this is so much harder than it needs to be. Really, is Honestly, guys, stop it. Guys, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Well, he died. That's fantastic. Gonna go back to town now. Um, so this is being a lot more difficult than I wanted it to be. Uh, I really thought I was gonna be able to do more damage, uh, which I probably would be doing a lot more damage if he wasn't stealing all of my um, my energy or my mana from me. If I had mana, uh, this would actually probably be a really easy boss fight. But uh, that is not the case because Diablo or Diablo, Bale is a jerk. We'll do that, pick up more potions, um, and head back in, I guess. 
and uh, use one of those there and and uh, start hitting bail I guess and looks like he's doing a crap ton of damage to us which is great and stealing all my mana like he always does um, ah, crap and we're gonna keep going with these basic attacks here because that's all we can do unfortunately ouch no don't kill me uh, oh, he killed my mercenary. So, that's awesome. I'm gonna run back here and talk to this guy, get my mercenary back, and uh, use that, and that, heal up, and head back in. Use another portal. I'm probably gonna have to buy some more of those um, at some point. And, and he is running away like a scared little kid. I'm going to try and get some hits off before he takes away all of my mana. Um, I think this is the real one. I'm actually not positive right now. And of course I can't hit anything, which is great. Uh, oh, I'm going to use a potion here really quick. And if I can get an attack off, that would be fantastic. And he is uh, at... Oh boy. He's at like uh, almost dead here. So we're going to... Hurry up and kill him. Hurry, please. Can use a potion. Can use another one of my potions to get some uh, charge ups. And he's almost dead, everybody. We can do it. 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 Please. Please. Hey, we did it. We did it, everybody. All right, so uh, we just killed Bell, and that was probably one of the harder boss fights. Uh, not quite as hard as. Diablo was, but still pretty hard. And yeah, that was Bale. As you can see, uh, I had quite a bit of trouble with it, even though throughout the most of the game, I really haven't had a whole lot of trouble in general. Uh, but, you know, that's how it goes. And we got Tyrael here. He's going to come talk to us for a little while, so we're going to see what he has to say. I am impressed, Moral. You have overcome the greatest challenge this world has ever faced and defeated the last of the prime evils. However, we are too late to save the Whirlstone. Bale's destructive touch has corrupted it completely. Uh, given enough time, the Whirlstone's energies will drain away and the barriers between the worlds uh, will shatter. The power of Hill uh, will flood into this sanctuary and eradicate your people and everything you've labored to build. Uh, therefore, I must destroy the corrupted worldstone before the powers of hell to take root. Uh, this act will change your world forever. The consequences even I cannot foresee. However, it is the only way to ensure mankind's survival. Go now, mortal. I have opened a portal that will lead you to safety. Uh, may the eternal light shine upon you and your des descendants uh, for what you've done this day. The continued survival of mankind is your legacy. Above all else, you have earned the rest from this endless battle. Uh, hurry for us. All right, so he opens up this portal that you can't see right here. Destruction's end. Uh, and this will get you out of uh, the Whirlstone Chamber and basically end the game for us. And yeah, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to head through the portal. And uh, that'll be the end of the episode. In the next episode, I will take on the secret cow level which will be a lot of fun uh but yeah this was bail everybody no big deal it was a hard battle but we got through it uh but yeah until next time leave a like with it if you like what you saw if you have any comments questions advice go ahead and leave those in the comment section and if you say up to date with what i'm doing here with my diablo 2 lore restriction let's play go ahead and hit that subscribe button but until next time hope you have a wonderful day and i'll catch you all next time